Welcome to live2clays.com, best e-learning portal for IIT JE, NEET and Foundation. Hello students, in this video I will discuss how to calculate molality, molarity and mole fraction. This is the problem given here and the problem says that calculate molality, molarity and mole fraction of uh, potassium iodide Ki if the density of 20% mass by mass equals Ki is 1.202 uh, gram per mole. Here you can see that uh, the density of uh, aqua solution is given 1.202 gram per mole and density is given 20% mass by mass. It means that the mass of solute is 20% and the rest is solvent. Then we can calculate the mass of solvent. Mass, mass of solute. Solute is Ki. Here we have potassium iodide is 20 gram. Then mass of solvent. Solvent is water because aqua solution is there. The mass of water H2O simply we subtract 20 from 100 it gives us the mass of water now we can calculate molality because molality formula is molality is equal to moles of solute upon the volume of solvent in kg solvent is h2o and it is given in gram we can convert it into a kg one kg has 1000 grams we can divide these values it will give us the value in grams 80 is divided by 1000 and the value which we get that is 0 0.08 0 0.08 kg this is the mass of h2o in kg moles moles of solute solute is uh, potassium iodide we can convert mass of potassium iodide into moles by using molar mass of potassium iodide. Molar mass of uh, potassium iodide is 166 gram per mole. You can calculate this value by using periodic table. Well, let's do the conversion. The moles, moles of potassium iodide is equal to, here we have 20 grams and the molar mass is 166 gram per mole means one mole has 166 uh, gram mass gram gram will cancel out and so we can do the calculation 20 is divided by uh, 166 and the value which we get that is 0 0.20 no sorry 0 0.120 here we have 0 0.120 and so these are the moles of potassium iodide now we can apply this formula simply we can plug in the values in this formula and calculate molality here we have molality it is the a part is equal to moles this is these are the moles 0 0.120 and uh, let me mention moles upon kg that is the mass of solvent and mass of solvent is 0 0.08 here we have 0 0.08 and it is in kg we can divide these values here we have at the top 0 0.120 and it is divided by 0 0.08 and the value which we get 1.5 here we have 1.5 and it is moles per kg this is the molality of solution now let's move on to the next part next part is molarity molarity here we have molarity means in the b part we are going to calculate molarity first we look at the formula in b part molarity it is capital m this is the difference molality is small m and so molarity is capital m and so molarity is equal to moles of solute moles of solute which we have already calculated here we have moles of solute upon the volume of solution in liters here we have i mentioned liters volume of solution in liters we don't know the volume of solution uh, in liters but we can calculate because here you can see the density is given here 1.202 gram per liters this is the density is given and mass is mass of solution is 100 gram we can apply density formula and we can calculate the volume of solution because uh, here solvent uh, solvent is 80 gram solute is 20 grams and so then mass of solution is 100 gram let's apply the formula density formula to calculate the volume of solution here we have density d is equal to m upon uh, here we volume in liters 
let's plug in the values density is given here density is 1.202 gram per ml 1.202 it is gram per ml it means that volume we uh, we will get in ml and mass is 100 gram 100 grams and here we have volume then volumes is equal to 100 gram upon the value which we have 1.202 and it is gram per ml we can uh, gram gram will cancel out and so you can divide these values 100 is divided by uh, 1.202 and the value which we get that is 83.19 83.19 and the ml goes up here we have ml since we need the volume of uh, solution in liters we can convert ml into liters so simply we divide it because uh, 83.19 ml multiplied by 1 liters has 1000 ml ml will cancel out and so you can divide these values it will give us the volume of solution in liters this is the value we get 0 0.0832 we can round out this figure 0 0.08 32 and liter this is the volume of uh, uh, volume of uh, solution now let's apply molar uh, molarity formula here we have mol uh, sorry it is capital m molarity is equal to moles of solute moles of solute we have already calculated that is 0 0.120 moles of potassium iodide 0 0.120 these are the moles and upon the volume of uh, solution volume of solution in liters 0.0832 and it is in liters now we can divide these values here we have at the top 0 0.120 and it is divided by 0 0.0832 832 and the value which we get that is 1.44 here we have 1.44 and this is moles per liter this is the molarity of solution now let's move on to the C part. In the C part, you can see that it is talking about mole fraction of potassium iodide. It means that we are going to calculate mole fraction of potassium iodide that is solute. Mole fraction of solute. We are that's what we are going to calculate. In C part, we have mole fraction. Mole fraction. And we know that the formula for mole fraction of solute is equal to at the top we write solute because we are going to calculate mole fraction of uh, uh, solute. Here we have mole mole fraction sorry yeah moles of here we have moles of solute means potassium iodide upon moles of solute plus moles of solvent moles of solvent it means that we are going to calculate the total number of moles present in a solution at the bottom at the bottom we have total moles of uh, solution at the top we have moles of solute in case if the question asks to calculate mole fraction of solvent then formula will be here we put solvent moles of solvent upon moles of solute plus moles of solvent that's the formula we will be using moles of solute we know means uh, moles of potassium iodide we have already calculated that is uh, 0 0.120 but moles of solvent we have not calculated yet here you can see that mass of solvent is given 80 gram it is given in gram simply we can convert the mass of solvent here we have let me write it at the bottom the mass of solvent is mass of solvent is 80 gram and so we can convert mass into moles by using molar mass here we have 80 grams we use dimensional analysis uh, uh, method molar mass of waters is 18 gram per mole that is very common molar mass means one mole has 18 gram mass gram gram will cancel out you can divide these values here we have 80 is divided by 18 and the value which we get that is 4.44 here we have 4.44 and it is the moles of solvent now we can apply this formula mole fraction here we have mole fraction fraction is equal to moles of solute means potassium iodide potassium iodide here we have moles of uh, potassium iodide 0 0.120 0 
zero point one two zero upon the it is in moles and at the bottom also we have moles of solute zero point one two zero plus moles of solvent here we have moles of solvent four point four four now at the bottom we can add the values here we have four point four four then add up zero point one two zero and see it gives us four point five six four point five six now we can divide these values uh, at the top we have zero point one two zero and it is divided by the bottom value and see it gives us zero point zero two six here we have zero point zero two six and it doesn't have any unit because at the top we have mole at the bottom we have mole same unit will cancel out and the value which we get 0 0.026 that is the mole fraction of solute potassium iodide you can see that how i calculate mo calculated molal molality molarity and mole fraction by using the formula here see, these are the data we were given and from this data we calculated the mass of uh, uh, solute then mass of solvent then accordingly we converted mass into moles and applied the formula and calculated these units of solution thank you if you like this video please click the like button if you have any questions or suggestions please comment below for more updates on iit je or need exams please subscribe to our channel to get lot of updates support us by following us on facebook and twitter to sharpen your skills please try out our test series on livetotalage.com thank you so much for watching have a great day